Now, keeping you and your family safe. This is Two Works For You Weather, certified most accurate. Cheer up with us early on this Thanksgiving morning. I guess it's a new meaning to the word early bird, right? Dan Threlkeld also up helping his wife. Isn't that nice? In the kitchen. Uh, this is their turkey, and he's sending everybody his warm Thanksgiving wishes. As far as what Mother Nature is serving up for today, it's going to be a warm turkey day. She's also going to be whipping up the wind. Plan on a strong south wind, especially by this afternoon. We're at 44 degrees right now through our Brookside cam. The wind out of the south southeast at 9 this morning. Do have some fog issues south of Tulsa, but that fog should burn off pretty quickly. 32 degrees right now in Bartlesville. You're the cool spot. 46 in Bristow. It's 44 in Muskogee. Here's the plan on Futurecast today. A mostly sunny sky in the forecast. Again, those south winds turning gusty at times. The wind picks up even further as we head through our Friday. Still out of the south for Friday, but we're tracking this approaching storm system. Friday morning will be dry. Most of Friday afternoon also looks dry, but you'll notice the clouds increasing. Our front really doesn't roll in, I'd say, until 10, 11 o'clock Friday night into early Saturday morning. So that's going to be our next best window of opportunity to see some showers and storms in here. Then as we head towards lunchtime on Saturday, the rain should be out of here. But it is going to be a very cold day with falling temperatures. 70 degrees are high today in Tulsa. 47 tomorrow morning. I have 68 on Friday, so warm today. Tomorrow turning much colder this weekend. 28 degrees Sunday morning with a high of 55. 56 on Monday will be in the low 50s Tuesday and Wednesday. By the way, if you're heading out tonight, tomorrow morning to uh, go shopping, I would love to see your pictures mm -hmm. as you're standing in line. So snap a picture, send it in to me at weather at kjrh.com, set your DVR. I'm going to show as many as possible tomorrow <laughs> and morning. Dan Perlman will be live uh, tomorrow morning right in the middle of all those crowds. So uh, hopefully he'll survive. See. Yeah, thank you, Julie.